Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. When you add multiple tables to a query in the query design view, the joins that you have established between tables within the relationships window appear in the query, allowing you to access information from any related tables. However, if you are attempting to create a query using unrelated tables, then you can create a temporary join between tables in the upper section of the query design view. For example, you would need to do this if you were trying to query two linked Excel tables using Access. Now you create the relationship in the same way that you created permanent joins between the tables in the relationships window. You simply click and drag the common field from one table and drop it on top of the related field in the second table. You can then edit the relationship between them to assist you in producing the desired results for your query. To do this, you can double click on the join line and the join properties dialog box will appear showing the names of the linked fields and the tables. Below that, select either option 1, 2, or 3 to determine how you want the result set to be displayed. Now when you have the desired settings, click the OK button. Query joins are particularly important as the type of join that you select can drastically affect your result set. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.